In this video I'm going to show you how to split a circle in half in Lightburn. So the first thing we want to do obviously is draw a circle. So I'm over here on the ellipse tool and I click on there and then I'm going to hold the shift key down while I draw a circle. If you don't hold the shift key down you're going to get this sort of shape and you don't really want that. So hold the shift key down while you do it and it creates a perfect circle. And then we come up to the select tool, click there so that it's selected. And then we want to come up to the arrange option up on the top menu. So if we click there and scroll down, you'll see this break apart option. So just click on that. And what this has done is broken apart all the different pieces. You can see here, everything's in pieces now. Now I'm just going to undo that. Because what I want to do is just select both the top two bits by clicking and dragging from the right hand side. So both of them selected. And then I'm going to right click and group. And now you can see I can move that out of the way. So that has split my circle in half. I do the same thing here as well. I want to group that so that both of them are grouped. So when I, now I can drag them around and they won't split apart. So that's it. That's pretty much what you do. But you can also complete the semicircle if you want. Create semicircles out of this by clicking on the line tool up here. And then coming over and you can see there's a cross here suddenly appears here. So I'll click there once and let go of the mouse. And you see once you do that, it, you, your mouse is followed by this line. Just move it across until you get to the other side and see the cross here. And then click once with your mouse. And then you'll see it's going to follow you around forever more here. So what we want to do is press the escape key to stop that from happening. Okay, so that's all you really need to do. And you can do the same here if you like as well. So there you go. That's how you split a circle in half in Lightburn. So thank you for watching and if you enjoyed this tutorial please give us a thumbs up, it really does help the channel. And thank you for watching.